All right, ladies and gentlemen, is Mr. Pages. I'll be doing some commentary, mostly on drill, um, maybe a little bit of music, but mostly on drill aspects that I saw from the top of the press box and some things that we can work on and, and think about as we go into chapter championships this weekend. Um, so I'm just going to hit play. I'll circle some things as we go through, and hopefully you'll learn a lot from this video. So here we go. One second. I need to start this video. Oh, no. All right. So I'll have to pause it as we go through, but here we go. Good salute, guys. Pit, it's very distracting while you're moving. I see a guard member moving in the back. Everyone is at attention, but you are moving. Our eyes move right to you. Any movement is noticeable. You got to pay attention. If you're at attention, you are at attention. <laughs> Yeah, we can see the holes here. You can see the other hole here. There looks like two or three people are missing. But still, that interval needs to be the same throughout. Here, these three flutes and that clarinet are very close to each other. What's this going on over here? Oh, no. But look at this arc. This is a beautiful... Although there's one person out of the arc right there. Some of you missed that step off on this right side here. Make sure we're attacking together, especially when we're at a hold. They're, they're scoring more on music at that point. We have one person out of step right here. Not out of step, but out of, out of the formation. Huge hole here, but I believe it's correct. Everyone's facing forward. Shoulders look good at this point. Now we see some issues with shoulders right here. They should be parallel, especially with those yellow, um, yellow shirt markers. It's very easy to tell if your sh shoulders are sh parallel or not to the sideline. A little phasing. Saxes, you need to be thinking the flute part. Flute, you need to be thinking the sax part. Notice how this transition right here, when we go from forward back, forward marching to back marching, it's not consistent. It looks really bad that only three of you are forward marching, but there's also the transition right there from the others. Good hit, good climax. And here's the peak of the song. Shoulders, shoulders, shoulders. Not everyone hit the hold at the same time. If you're late, our eyes go to you. Shoulders, flutes, for the most part, you're good. But mm, shoulders over here, baritone alto, or bar baritone and tenor saxophone. Make sure we're all consistent with that drop horns. Overall, that was very good for the first song. Pit, pay attention. Don't talk. Looks bad. Shoulders. Oh, my goodness. Look at this. We have people literally going directly towards the 50. I say parallel, not perpendicular to the sideline. Flutes, that's much better with that line, with the high note to the low note. What is this? Stefan, what are you doing? I shouldn't see your shoulders move that much. We need to look at consistency of what the kneeling trumpets are doing during that solo. Will, good job. It sounded great. Shoulders. Look at this. And Kamisha's right there. There's no excuse. 
especially when you're turning around. But only two people forward march, then transition to a back march. You're either back marching that whole time, you guys are making up moves. Kamisha's right there. I don't know why you're facing the 50. It needs to be consistent. If you're all going to face the 50, that's one thing. But if it's just one person, it's not good. Especially since Kamisha's right there. Guard, I love the work. Same thing with that symbol, it gets to that point where it's just too loud. It can't get any louder, it doesn't sound musical. And we still have someone turned over here. Why are we moving when we're at attention? My eyes go straight to you. Love it. A lot of wobbling right here from this baritone. That was a nice transition right here. But shoulders, guys, shoulders. I know it's fast backwards marching. There was no transition right here from one set to the other. And the shoulders over here again. Shoulders. Shoulders. Shoulders again. Oh my goodness, you guys are facing the 50. Overall, your holds are great. Horn angle, what is this? Is that how you drag your trombone around? No. Shoulders, and you're on right on the 50. There's no reason for this. And I know you can all put your shoulders to the sideline because you do it during the holds. So I know you can see the drum major at all times. And our shoulders should be at, towards the sideline even in this visual. Drumline, I give you credit. With only half your members there, that still sounded amazing. Good job. Brass wins in general. You need to be subdividing during that drum break. You can't just dud out. You need to be thinking one and two and three in. It shouldn't take you four counts to turn around. It should be one or two counts at the most. But good turnaround. Awesome. Shoulders. Watch out trumpets. You should be hitting that line at 16 counts or 26 counts. And here you need to be thinking Okay, when do I step kneel, step kneel, step kneel? Here he comes, here he comes, here he comes, and step, step kneel, step kneel, step kneel. Ladies and gentlemen, that was overall was really good. Um, there are some things we can still work on, especially, I'm gonna go back here. Look at this trumpet line over here. You're gonna watch these three trumpets, they're gonna back up from the 50 to the 45. This should not be a line at all until that 26th count. But look what happens. So we're moving, we're moving. All right, there's only two trumpets out now. That's wrong. Another trumpet's in. That's still wrong. The only person who's right is the person who looks like they're wrong. Right here. Because he's taking all 26 counts to get to his spot. And you'll see what happens. He goes 26 counts back there. And then he steps off in the new direction. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So that's what's supposed to happen all for everyone in this set. Everyone's getting there too early. Again, everyone. So the only person who was right in this entire set was the person who looks like they're wrong because everyone else is taking about 24 steps to get to their spot, marking time for two. The move is 26 counts. 
Now we need to be careful of that. Make sure we're taking all 26 counts to get there. And that goes for all these sets. Uh, I don't see any other shoulder issues. This big thing right here, this person is heading towards the 45. Shoulder should be at the sideline, parallel to the sideline. But you'll see that the issue is, is when you return to facing the sideline, there's a huge turn. And the only, the, the reason why it's so big besides appearance is that your sound is going to an audience in the end zone. There is no audience in the end zone. Your audience is towards that press box. But like I said, ladies and gentlemen, overall, the show is very good. Obviously, we have some phasing issues and we have some visual things that we need to clean up. Um, but overall, ladies and gentlemen, I'm, I'm proud of you guys and you've been doing a lot of hard work and just keep it up and we'll have a great rest of this year between chapters and ACC. All right, Mr. Pages is out. Thanks for listening.